Hey there, this is Madison Woods. I'm an artist in Northwest Arkansas who makes her own watercolor paints from the rocks that I find here. Making videos is new to me, so bear with me as I try to figure this out. You want to hear some bloopers of audio at the end? They're there. I think they make a funny addition. I'll keep them as I learn how to do this better. Anyway, what I'm here today to show you is how I check the rocks to see if they're going to make good enough color to make paint. I'm not going to talk a lot, so if you have questions, drop them in the comments. So what I'm doing right now is looking at the rocks to see which ones look like they might be a good candidate. I'll take this big one and rub it on another rock to see how the color looks. So I'll do this repeatedly until I have all the colors I want for a little palette. Then I'll take them home, crush them, wash them, and make some paint. That's another story for another video though. Now this one isn't giving enough color really to make it worth my effort. I think I'll throw that one out. This little smooth rock isn't sandstone, it's shale and it gives a beautiful smooth gray. That's it for today. I'll see you next time. Hi, I am Madison Woods, an artist from Northwest Arkansas. I make my paints from these rocks that we have here on our property. Most of what we have is sandstone. Hi, I'm Madison Woods of Wild Ozark. You can find us in the middle of northwest Arkansas's Ozark Mountains. Shit, I did it again. Hi there, this is Madison Woods of Wild Ozark. I'm an artist in northwest Arkansas, and I make my paint from the rocks and other pigments that I find here on our property in Madison County, near Kingston, Arkansas. Today I want to show you a little bit about how I test the rocks to see which ones I want to use.
I'm not going to talk a whole lot, just a little bit. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. And like and subscribe if you'd like to keep... Almost made this one.